I just got wrecked. My trust wallet was hacked for $15,000. And welcome back to the Rock Cloud channel. And if you guys like to get rich and you like to invest, whether that's stocks and or cryptocurrencies, please smash that subscribe button and tap the thumbs up. It's free to subscribe and you get a lot of value out of the channel. So why not? Today's video is going to be about awareness, okay? Hack awareness and also about the BNB coin specifically and where we're going to head with that as a price target, etc. But if you guys could also help me out with this, I would greatly appreciate it, okay? I'm very careful with how and where I store my coins and where I do my trading. I do not understand what went wrong in this process. And this is very disturbing to me right now, okay? Very disturbing, okay? It drained all the energy out of my system when I saw this message pop up on my iPad. Okay, when this notification alert popped up on my iPad, okay, right away, I looked at it and I'm like, first thing I think of is, hey, I didn't send any BNB to anybody. Like, what's this about? So I tap on that message and it brings me to my trust wallet and specifically into my BNB wallet. Okay, and I now have zero BNB and I am aggravated. Okay, I would like some help trying to resolve this issue if it is even possible. If there are any hackers that watch this channel, please hit me in the comments. I would really appreciate that. Okay, so 26 BNB coins were swiped from my trust wallet, basically right in front of my eyes. It's insane. And the transaction, once you get that notification, it's gone in seconds. Like you don't have time. There is no cancellation. You, even if you shut off your device, that's not going to help you because this is a blockchain transaction. Okay. Once that is in play, it's gone. Okay. And here's the hash transaction. Okay. This is the blockchain transaction. Okay. Here's the hash right here. Total success. Okay. Just crush me. Okay. And they took 26 BNB from my wallet. I also want to make sure that you guys are aware to disconnect your pancake swap exchange from the trust wallet. Okay. You need to disconnect that integration. Okay. And at that time, that's the first thing I went to check. I was like, oh my God, maybe this is a backdoor through pancake and they got into my account. Something happened and I'm not sure where my 12 seed is actually printed on a piece of paper. It's not stored in the device at all. Okay. It's on a piece of paper physically printed and left here in my house. So I don't understand where the disconnect was, but I went to the pancake swap um, exchange and to check the status of my trust wallet connection and I was logged out. So what you guys do from the trust wallet, you go to your pancake exchange and from the top right, okay, you're going to tap your account here where I have it circled and it's going to pop up this dialog. Okay. When this pops up, make sure you tap log out every time you use the pancake swap, be sure to disconnect log out from the pancake exchange. Do not leave your pancake exchange connected to the trust wallet. Even though mine was disconnected, okay, I still got hacked. I don't understand it. I really don't. But make sure that you're following this as well. Okay, and this is another step you guys want to check on your trust wallet. And this is something that is not enabled by default. And I did not have this enabled. Now it's enabled. But what good is it? So when you go into your settings from trust wallet and you tap security, Okay, it brings you here to the security tab and the app lock is off by default. Okay, now it's on and you set a passcode. Okay, but what good is that not coming on by default? Okay, and I just had a lot of movement going on in that wallet and I wasn't paying attention specifically to these settings. Okay, and I usually am on top of my game. Okay, and there it is again. Okay, that transaction minus 26 BNB leaving my wallet and sucked me dry. I just got wrecked. Okay. So if you guys could help me out, I would appreciate that. Now let's start talking about the BNB coin specifically. BNB is the token of the Binance exchange. BNB is constantly burning tokens. Okay. Which decreases the circulating supply, which makes BNB specifically a scarce asset over time. Okay, every quarter Binance burns BNB tokens. 
in this quarter, over 1 million tokens were burned. And at the time of burning, the value was approximately $600 million. Okay, this was the biggest burn in the history of the Binance token. Right now, Binance Coin is ranked number three and trading just over $500 at the time of making this video. Let's check out the chart of the BNB coin. Okay, has a market cap of over $78 billion. It's incredible. And it has a circulating supply currently of 155 million coins. Okay, there are 7 billion people in the world. The Binance coin is a global movement. Okay, it's accessible globally. 7 billion people in the world, 155 million coins circulating supply right now everybody in the world could not even have one very scarce asset this is going to be a very valuable coin in the future okay this circulating supply is going to become lower and lower and lower over time and mark my words okay as long as the market regains traction and starts moving back in that direction i do see bnb coin finishing the year between 800 and 1000 dollars okay i was stacking bnb high okay at 565 and i accumulated basically all 26 coins right about that level okay and that's about fifteen thousand dollars by the way okay now getting back to the coin right now the circulating supply is going to decrease as i had mentioned it's very important that you guys understand the value behind the bnb coin okay so that's going to drive the, the total price of each coin up higher over time not now okay but in five years from now okay the bnb coin is most likely going to be a five thousand dollar coin okay in five years from now okay i'm talking like 2026 four thousand to five thousand okay and then five more years from then okay which is ten years from now that could be a nine ten thousand dollar coin and that was my play, okay? My plan was to accumulate the BNB as a long-term hold, and I got wrecked. Please hit me in the comments, whether it's for sympathy or you want to add value to this video and you have more information specifically about the BNB coin, I would appreciate that. Thank you for watching. Please smash that subscribe button and tap the thumbs up. Get rich or die trying with Rock Cloud. I'm out.